Hey everybody, it's Rob and Andrew, and today we're looking at a bunch of pedals from Game Changer Audio. I've used a bunch of these before. Rob's never seen any of them, some of them? I actually have seen this one. That's a wild one. Well, they're all wild. Like all yeah, of them yeah. do something that I've never seen before. Okay, when it says it has plasma, Oh, it has, it, it has, has plasma. plasma. What exactly is plasma? Plasma is like the state beyond gas. The state Electrical, beyond gas? Um, yeah. So if you stink, it's so bad. You get here. Are we both? Yeah, this is All so right. fun. Both going through I, the I've same I've never pedals. gone through the same pedals with someone. Are you seeing this light up as we play? Yeah. The light. The light pedal is a reverb pedal, and it's got uh, it's a spring, the spring tank in here. Yeah, the spring vibrates, yeah. and then you turn it back into audio. Yeah, that is But this has an extra is. layer where there's also these lights, and they're using infrared sensors to see how the spring is moving and taking that as a reverb signal. So actually, play something like somewhat steady. Ooh. Oh, that's nice. Ooh. Do you feel a song coming on already? Oh, Actually, oh, another fun thing that I'm thinking of right now is this gate knob. So you can have it where there's more reverb the louder you play, or the louder oh. you play, the more it ducks the reverb. Yeah, and for people, like, gate is kind of, like, imagine a gate that, like, stops something, for, and you're controlling a gate. It's kind of... Closing the door yeah, on the sound. Yeah, I mean, I'm sure there's a better way that I could describe it, but that's essentially... You can dial wow. in how much you want to gate it. Whoa, oh, bring, bring the gate all the way up. And then you can go from like. So reverby. And then it's just dead. Ooh, but then there's cool. the opposite. Wait, wait, I want to play around with that oh, for you a play little with bit. That? Yeah, okay. that's so cool. Let's do it. That's so weird. Ooh. Okay, I, I feel I feel a song coming on. Should we bring in the band? Let's bring in you the guys band. Good? Ready? You know it. Okay, one, two, three, four. You want to keep jamming on this, or should we try the I other? I think we should move on. Yeah, book? I think we should move on. Okay, I don't like. So I don't like what the band did. the gate the other way. Um, it means there's no reverb while you're playing, and then when you let go, whoa. it swells in. Let's do the same song with the band, but now oh, the other yeah, way. Yeah, yeah, yeah. It's yeah. dry, so, and then we fill the space with yeah, reverb. Yeah, yeah. Sick. All right. One, one two, two, same three. song. Dang, that is Beautiful. cool. That sounds like we're playing, and once we stop, it's like the sound wants to go into a cave, and once we stop, it can <laughs> finally just shoot into a cave. <laughs> I really wanna go, I really wanna go. Wow, that uh, was great. Okay, you guys are doing better. Um, thank you. Mm. Okay, so the next mode is sweep, where the lights automatically change, and you can okay. control the rate of them. So this will just, I guess, affect the tone of the reverb. Oh, yeah, uh-huh. E major, and then to this one. Oh yeah. Mm. Now, so here's a feedback mode. So now the signal is going into the spring, being read by the lights, and then that signal is going back into the spring yeah. and being read by the lights, and that's how Over you get a feedback. Well, yeah. yeah, both the spring and the lights are we're hearing right now. All right, there's one more mode. It's called harmonic. And this one adds like a shimmer sort of thing. I don't know so, how So now uh, the whole thing we just described, but then adding, accentuating certain harmonics of the spring. Yeah. Ooh. I'll just, I'll be the pedal guy. Yeah. Ooh. We are both in our natural habitat. <laughs> now you're turning knobs and I'm playing guitar. <laughs> Ooh, it sounds like, it kind of sounds like there's a bunch of screaming gremlins, but like they're happy. <laughs> All right, let's, let's move on. So this next pedal 
is called the plus pedal. So you play. Oh. And you can hold oh, whatever. Oh, man. <laughs> and that. you can have a blend between the dry and the wet. I think you can have it like fade in. I'll turn down the, the fade so it's just like instantly kicked in. I would hate to communicate that to make good music, you just need gear. <laughs> I really don't want to do that, but man, it's fun. On the second pedal, I know, and I could be here could all write day. An album like, with be here each all of these. day. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> so for the next ones, we could probably do these at the same time because they're variations Very of similar. the same thing. We've got yeah. the plasma pedal, and, <laughs> and the then plasma, plasma coil. coil was their collaboration with Jack White. Oh, cool. And these cool. are just like some. I love it. You can see it. So it's going into the plasma and yeah. overdriving the plasma, which is essentially well, distortion. You put a signal the, the into the audio is actually analyze. turning into that yeah. electricity. Yeah, yeah, we're seeing turn the audio it back into audio. Yeah, I wonder if I play a low note, if the plasma is less. Oh yeah, and give it a high note. Yeah, oh, yeah, totally. yeah, totally, totally. So it's fully just like waves. It's frequency. Yeah. What if we double up? <laughs> hey, that's kind of like an octave fuzz if I'm doing the octave and you're doing it. Oh, I thought you were doing the same thing as me. You were up an octave? I, uh, halfway through, I went up an octave. Oh, cool. And that's why it sounded yeah. like octave fuzz. <laughs> <laughs> well, there is actually an octave fuzz on this one. Whoa, let's do it. Time for a quick sponsored message. The perfect background music can make such a big difference to your videos. The perfect background music can make such a big difference to your videos. The perfect background music can make such a big difference to your videos. So if you don't already know about Epidemic Sound, they are sponsoring today's video. They make it really easy to find great music for your content because every track is high quality and they're all categorized really well and searchable. And you can play them all right from your browser or from the Epidemic Sound app. Some tracks have stems, so for instance, this sounds pretty cool, but if I wanted, I could just use the instruments. Or just the drums. And on top of that, there's this fine similar button where it'll show you similar tracks, or you can even highlight part of a track you like and it'll show you sections of other tracks that are sonically similar. So you can really zero in on what music is gonna best serve your project. Click the link in the description to sign up for a free 30-day trial and anything you use from Epidemic Sound, even if it's during the trial and even if you ever cancel, can remain in your content for life and it will be protected from copyright strikes and takedowns. Thanks so much to Epidemic Sound for making today's video possible. Let's get back to Sonic Boom. So this one has a blend knob, so you can get your dry signal in there. Oh, yeah. And this one replaces the blend knob with a bunch of different options. So let's, let's okay. switch over to this yeah, one. We don't want the dry signal. <laughs> so I think there's octave down, octave up, a few octave different varieties. Up. So in the middle, this is like a mode knob. Whoa, dude. What? That's wow. insane. I love that. Okay, well, I think we have to play um, the 1st of October song I was just playing. What, what is that? Oh, Headless? Headless, yeah, we gotta play some of Headless with the, uh, with the band. Yeah, man.
what about just pure sludge? Okay, can I just do that with the band real quick? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Right. <laughs> One, two, three, four. Yeah, yeah, that's all I need. Oh, man. I, that's all I need. Thanks, guys. <laughs> yeah. Let's just get to the, the Bigsby's. All right, so. And, and we have two of them. Oh, man. Oh. That's a really clean pitch shift. Yeah. And and why do we have two? Just just to go well, up two, two octaves? So we, no, we can have different settings. I mean, we could do that. We could do two oh, in a row. Oh yeah. So, so what? <laughs> <laughs> but I was thinking you can you can set it to yeah, any yeah. semitone amount or even microtones. Oh, yeah, of course. So we could do one where it's like we're playing, we go up an octave. We're playing, we go up a fifth or something like that. But also you can go the other way. Oh wait, no, this is doing a tremolo now. There we go. Depends on the setting. You okay, can also, so, there's so an inverting like switch. Yeah, so now we could go like this This way's up and this way's down. Well, that's up. Oh, never mind. I just flipped it around. Anyway. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> so this one. You can choose oh, which so one's, one's up, or up down. and this one down. Yeah. And then here you go. Here's the most expensive way to just be in the same spot. <laughs> <laughs> but I was thinking we could change one to like just the tone down, one to. A fifth up yeah, or something. Yeah. yeah, so here we got one at a minor six and one at a octave Ooh. down. We could do like. Imagine just getting one for each note. Though. Yeah, oh my God. <laughs> you had a, every big B is a, is a different semitone. Yeah. So you could just play like da, da, like a piano. Yeah. Oh, could we go through the plasma too, though? <laughs> All right, we need the band. All right, well, let's play this, guys. One, two, three, four. I'll add some octaves, maybe. I forgot it goes the other way too. Let's end with just a few notes here. Bump, 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 whatever. Great job, oh guys. God. Was that the video? You are so creative. I know there's another dream just around the it's, corner for you. It's just like I've been working. You're gonna smash it. At this restaurant You're for not so even long. gonna remember what Chuck E. Cheese is.